Community is great, but it takes a little bit of work to make a community healthy and strong. Fortunately, we have help through the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is the only one who can create real fellowship between believers. And it all starts with commitment. You know, one of the dangers we face when building community comes from our experiences with the families we know. Because sometimes our, we grow up in unhealthy families, we lack the skills needed to build strong community. But we can learn. The New Testament is filled with useful instruction that can help us learn how to build a community that God wants us to live in. A healthy community is built on honesty, humility, courtesy, confidentiality, and frequency. It takes commitment. Commitment that you must make. God has so much for you. Experiencing life in a supportive and loving community can change who we think we are and help us become the person that God wants us to be. What's it going to take for you to say, I want what God wants for me? Consider this verse for the day. We understand what love is when we realize that Christ gave his life for us. That means we must give our lives for other believers. If you're ready and willing to step out and build that community, it's going to require that you commit yourself to giving up your life for those around you. When we can do that, then we'll begin to experience the community that God wants. We'll see you next time.